Hello everyone, this is the VIP. Um, I notice most people don't even know how to um how to install applications I sent via WhatsApp. I will show you how to do that, please. Um, I might not be able to send some link. At times, if I send link to one or two person, they find it difficult to download. So I will be sending it via WhatsApp to either via link or via WhatsApp. So if you don't know how to um, install application that is sent to you on WhatsApp, please this video will be helpful. It's very simple. Once someone sends anything to you on WhatsApp, it's very simple. How do you get it? Every phone has file manager. If you don't have file manager, you have something like file explorer like this. Do you understand? Or file manager or whatever name it is. If you have been sent anything on WhatsApp, normally by default, except if you have higher version of phone, then um, and your settings is always and your phone settings is um um allows um installation from whatsapp then you don't have issues but if your phone default setting does not allow installation from whatsapp this is how you do it for example now let's assume i want to install this application on whatsapp now i have this application okay now this particular application now i want to install it from whatsapp if i click on this app if you notice when i try to open it it will give it will either bring me back or to show me an error message that my phone cannot install blah 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 just go to your file explorer or file manager now under your file explorer or file manager um, explore all the folders you have access to exploring all the folders in your phone all the application each application on your phone has its own folder now you locate whatsapp folder now there are two three different types of whatsapp well, they are all whatsapp some have been modded now we have whatsapp we have whatsapp plus we have gb whatsapp now I'm using GB WhatsApp now. It's the same thing with your normal WhatsApp. All you just have to do is locate WhatsApp folder, like you can see. This is my own WhatsApp folder. You touch it, you touch it. Once you touch it, you see about five other options, five other folders, teams, media, database, backup, and backups. Now I'm going to click on media. Click on media on your phone. Once you click on media on your phone, now you see all the folders on your phone, the audio, the document. Now any document or application that has been sent to you stays under the document for the whatsapp folder that is whatsapp if it's images you get it under images photos and the rest of them now what i send to most of you um, um is application you go to document once you go to document you see list of all the applications you see you see list of ad applications sent to you on phone it install it from here in most cases the application might just rename itself if how do you identify or differentiate between an um um an android application and um ordinary document of file at times i might send application to you and the end of it maybe at the end of the the name you might not see something like um dot apk whenever i see application or file that ends with dot apk as you can see like this other one that is telling that you're dealing with um android um extension file android file but once you are uh but once you end with apk because at times whatsapp automatically rename the apk to something else she understands another just go there clean the other extension it could be something like m um, blah blah whatever it is just clean the remainder and make sure the last um, number or alphabet ends with dot apk then you are good to go then you install directly from here it will work please i'm not going to repeat this if you cannot install whatsapp or any application that is sent to you on whatsapp then use this method thank you